Hey, man. Hey. How are you holding up? Got a splitting headache. Feel like I've barely slept, even though I've slept a lot. Jeez, you okay? I don't know. Can I do anything? Kill me? Wake me up somehow? Hey. Whoa. Wake up! Okay, yeah, I'm awake now. So what are you up to today? You wanna go check out that historical society? You sure? You seem like really tired. Yeah, let's do this. Okay, so we can do these, is it? Uh-oh. I think we need to do the graveyard with B and then... Will that wrap up story time? Sorry we crashed. It's okay. Is your bike okay? Yeah, I can fix it. I'm handy. It's too bad you didn't get run over. It's too bad you didn't crash into a train. It's too bad your corpse didn't get eaten by scavengers. All of these do. Too bad you didn't get eaten by scavengers alive. Hehe. <laughs> so that's it, huh? Yep. Never been out here before? Me either. Oh, uh, I thought you had a plan. Who needs a plan? We're just breaking into an old house. Crimes. Yep. It looks kinda, uh, exactly like a haunted house. Yeah! Like the one on the cover of that book, Haunting of Arbor Street. We have an Arbor Street. Yeah, book spooked me pretty good as a kid. Big evil house. This place looks exactly like it. Well, you're looking for a ghost, right? I think it might be looking for me, actually. Oh yeah, the other night. Yeah. Well, whoever this is, maybe we'll get some info here. It's not like a person, dude. It's a ghost. Uh, right, well... Let's go find us a ghost. Oh boy, breaking and entering crimes. Oh what, Greg? Hey, where are you? Over here. Oh yeah. Found the basement doors. What? Stop yelling. Why are you talking like that? If you say fa instead of f, it's harder. For someone, for example, a ghost. You hear that? You're speaking. I have no idea what you're saying here. Okay, we're trying to be stealthy, right? Oh, okay. Yeah, I get what you're saying. Thank you. I'm not going to do that. Okay. We're fine. Nobody's here. No lights on. Doors are locked. So how are we doing this? You are going to hold the flashlight. Oh, so there's a flashlight. While I pick this lock. You can pick locks? I totally forgot. Yeah, dude! This is kind of awesome. It sure is. Crimes, dude. Crimes, dude. Hey, you wanna shine that light down here? Cool, thanks. Oh my god, what was that? Nothing. Uh-huh. Hey, more light, please. I'm scared. I feel like I know what's gonna happen. I'm scared. What the fuck? Okay, there's something up there. Told you. Alright, let's finish this. Also, watch my back. Basically, do both. I'm spooked! Hey, you up there! Oh no, Gregory! 
friggin... Ow. Oh. Are you okay? Thanks, sir. That was dangerous. I didn't know owls attacked like that. What was his effing deal? So we're in the basement. What are we actually looking for, by the way? The thing I read said that sometimes when someone stays late, they hear weird things. In something called the map room. And in, and in some off-limits area. Technically all of this is an off-limits area right now. True, dude. True. Dude, is that like two elevators and not like old ones? Locked too? Jeez, maybe this place is all elevators. Weird. Why would you have two? One for the ghosts and one for the normies. Naturally. Private rooftop ghost party. With a ghost pool. I hope you get squished by the elevator. I hope your head gets stuck in the door. And gets chopped off. I hope you fall down an elevator shaft. I hope you get trapped in a dark elevator filled with water. And an angry shark. Holy crap, dude. That's... Alright. These two. Okay. Here we go. These two, honestly. Looks pretty empty. And dark. Hey, where's the flashlight? Crap. I left it outside. Dude! You were being attacked by an owl. Alright, well. I can see, okay? Me too. Let's look around. Close for insurance purposes. Portion stairs not for climbing. These stairs are original to the house and are not functional at this time. What the hell are non-functioning stairs? So are we just supposed to like... Levitate? Oh. I feel like we're gonna jump up there anyway. Oh, check it out. Elevator number three. Looks like it's not locked either. Elevators for miles, dude! Yeah, this is weird. How do we jump up on this? No. Is anyone spooked by this historical society just yet? Are you gonna go? Are you gonna go? Why do I have to go first? It's your ghost. Okay, fine. It's not even real. What? Dude, what? Oh. What? The hell? Was that? I don't know. Is someone here? No. Lights off, doors locked, no cars outside. Okay, so... Do you want to go back? Do you have your knife? Yeah? Okay. Wait, is the assumption that I'm gonna stab someone? Is that the plan now? No, I mean, just in case. I mean... The basement door locked behind us. Alright, oh, crap. Gonna have to find another way out too. Hold on, let me add that to the list. Map room, forbidden zone, find a way out. This is complicated. Crimes. Crimes. Is this map room? I don't think this is map room. Oh, hey. Awesome massacre. Oh, nice. You remember this, right? Not super well. Yeah, there was this big explosion at one of the old mines. And it could have been avoided or something. And then the miners went on strike because they were getting screwed and killed. And like, it went on a while. And other minds and places joined up, like, to be like, you've messed with all of us. That's awesome. Yeah, the bosses and the governor, they sent in, like, soldiers and stuff? Because they're assholes? And some kid or something threw a rock at one of them, and the soldiers, like, opened fire. Holy crap! Where did this happen? Northwest end of town. There's, like, a marker for it. Oh, that's awful. Bosses are bad. Bosses are bad. Weird how, like, we're all supposed to look up to, like, bosses. Just in general. 
Like, even bad ones. Yeah, I refuse. Extremely ditto. Okay, well, nothing weird here. Educational, even. I feel like we're getting smarter. My brain is too huge as it is, dude. Gonna pop. If that happens, I'm leaving your headless corpse here. Aha, they'll be so freaked out in the morning. Nice. Oh, Ronald, I'm going to open this room for the day. Ah! I say, this chap's brain appears to have burst. Bring them up, won't you, Ronald? <laughs> oh my god, these two. These two are adorable. Holy crap, is that elevator number four? Ow. Why? Grandad would be complaining about local tax dollars right now. Oh. What was that? That is not cool. Maybe it's like someone left a phone here and that's uh probably that. Probably. Probably. Rhymes. Rhymes. Guess we're going in the elevator. Going up. I'm sure if I'm going up or down, honestly. You're kidding me. Elevator number five. Hmm. Locked. I think this is as high as we're going to going without picking some locks, so. Oh crap. You're kidding me. Drop the lockpick stuff out back. You're kidding me. I was being attacked by an owl. Okay. Sorry. Can you like improvise? Uh need some pliers and you got a paper clip? Uh no. Who who walking around on Earth today is carrying a paperclip? Nobody. So like, okay, just so I got this straight now. Shoot. Map room, forbidden zone, find a way out, find pliers, find paperclip. I think that's it. This is so stupid. This is like work. This is all work. What's happening? Did you hear that? Yeah. Didn't sound like a person. Yeah, I don't know what that was. Okay, well, let's hurry. What was that, even? We found a door. Oh, some poor things. Oh, hey, it's my neighborhood. And the highway. No hand panther, though. Must be old. Oh, wait. We're in the map room. Well, let's be extra careful. Okay. Rhymes. Rhymes. There's the graveyard and the building we're in right now. Spooky. Like we're being watched. Hey, it's my neighborhood. Wow, there's a tiny you in there, I bet. Well, that's... Sorry, that like made me dizzy. I'm dangerous. This kid, I love it. I love Gregory. Good old towny sentry. Town is center, the center of our town. Quite. Oh, I think that's the old food donkey. And the woods your ghost guy ran into? Yep. He sure gets around for a dead guy. That he does. Uh oh. What the heck is this? Creepy noise again. In this room. Oh. Hey, check it out. Toolbox. Repair guy must have left through the night halfway through fixing it. And hey, some pliers! Oh, cool, cool, cool. I was thinking we'd never find them again and just, like, starve in here. There'll be people here in the morning. Alright. Oh, so, we need a paperclip. I'm sure there's a paperclip somewhere in this place. They probably have, like, an office or something. Probably with, like, nine elevators in it. Nine? Okay. <laughs> ah, it's alive. Jeez, that thing's ugly. Well, this was the source of the noise, I guess. 
mystery solved. Wait. No. If it was making that noise, that means that someone was in here while we were walking around. Oh. Yeah, let's maybe go. No, we have to find stuff. Oh, stuff? Dude, we're gonna get tasered or something by a big bulking uh, historical society employee. Yeah, they're pretty dangerous. Whatever. I'm blaming you if this goes bad. Fine. Fine. I'm sorry, dude. Me too. I'd never turn you in. Me either. Crimes. Crimes. I guess we're going down then. We're going up or down? My theory is if we... Oh, we're in the office. Let's go. Are other people going on weird ghost hunting adventures? And they're looking for like, cool shit. Okay, well. Yeah, let's find a paperclip. Like, big ass stapler. Do donut wolf receipt. Ride that chariot, Nancy. Picture of a dang hound dog. Picture of some dang kids. Found one. Alright, so we got the stuff. Let's get that elevator open and see what's upstairs. Gonna guess it's like 12 more elevators. Oh joy. So we just go up again, up again, right? What does it take me there? This is a bit spooky. Alright, we ready to go? Yeah, for sure. Gonna get to work. I'm gonna like, break out of county jail someday with these skills. Dude, what are you going to jail for? Probably something like this, honestly. When did Greg become so handy and awesome? Ah, uh, dude. You need to hurry. What? Oh god, what's this sound? What is this sound? Someone's coming. They're in the hallway downstairs. Crap, okay, I'll have done it in... Oh god. Uh, dude. The elevator. Hurry, I'm scared! There, I got it. <gasps> I'm scared, go! Oh, we made it. Oh, we're back down here. Are we, are we in the basement? Oh, okay. Oh, hey, that's where the elevator goes? This elevator. Yeah, so... This doesn't make a lot of sense. Maybe, like, this elevator is for loading things for the map room. And, like, they use the other one to avoid the stairs. But even then. Dude, none of this makes sense. Doesn't look like whatever that is is following us down here. Whatever, not whoever. Whoever. Are you coming around on this ghost thing? Ghosts don't use elevators. Why? So a ghost could walk up the stairs or something, but elevators are out of the question? So the question I have is, where does that one go? Okay. Crimes? Crimes. Okay, just gotta pick this. In the dark. Jeez, sorry. It's cool, I... Oh. I'm gonna keep picking. You see if we can get out through the back. Stuck. We are so screwed. I'm working, I'm working. Oh god, I'm scared. It's locked. Something locked it. Someone. We can go back upstairs? Actually, no. We're just gonna get chased around in a circle. By whatever it is. Whoever it is. Dude! And got it. We don't know where this is gonna go. Got any better ideas? Dude, clearly I don't. Ah. Uh. 
I'm scared, slightly scared of where we're gonna end up. We have an elevator that goes from the basement to the attic, with no stops in between. What in the actual crap? Quick, let's find a way out. Oh wait, why, why did he run away? I found a window. I think there's a fire escape. Window doesn't open though. Oh. Oh my god. What is this place? Forbidden Zone. What is that? Are they starting a weird art museum? This is bad art. This is weird. It's art, dude. What the? No, this is familiar. How do I know this? Uh-oh. Dude, the elevator. Why do I know this painting? Dude, come on. Why do I know this painting, chat? The elevator's coming back up. Is that what we see in our dreams or something? Hurry! Yeah, I'm thinking weird dreams. He's all hurry! Can I not just. Oh. Oh, what? Greg, where did you go? The steps just ended, you gotta jump. Oh, I think I landed on Greg. Ow. <gasps> you believe me now? I believe we almost got caught by a security guard or something. No, I'm telling you. I can like, feel it. Okay, fine. Ghost, ghost security guard. Sorry about all of this. You crashed your bike, got mauled by an owl, broke through a window, and jumped off a fire escape. Nah, dude, wasn't nothing. You're a really good- you're a really good friend, Greg. Grimes. Grimes. Oh, whoa, what's this? No damage- if no fall damage if you land on your teammate, true. What the hell was that? What just happened? What the heckins? Ah! Dude, what's wrong? Uh... Um... Dude, talk to me! Jeez, my head. We need to talk to everyone tonight. Okay, can you get on the bike? I think so. Okay, grab onto me and I'll get us home quick. What about the ghost? Ain't no ghosts here. Let's go. Oh, this is taking a turn? Thanks for, like, coming. Again, we live here. Yeah, you're in my living room. I'll accept the thanks. So, like, do you have any an idea of what's going on? Uh, there's a ghost following me. There's a ghost in my head. There's a ghost in my head. Like, the night after I saw the kidnapping, or I think it was a kidnapping. I had this dream I barely remember. Except for this sound. This horrible sound and this feeling. And I keep hearing it whenever the ghost gets nearby. And it's like someone rips a hole open in my brain. I know you guys don't believe me. It's not that I don't believe that something's happening with you. I just don't know that it's a ghost. Yeah, dude. There are like 50 better explanations for all of this. Like what? You have like sudden stress migraines and you saw something that freaked you out. It makes you stress out. I get migraines. And May, you've gone through a lot of changes, life changes recently. And I don't know, stress does weird things to people. Okay, fine, fine, whatever. I'm going up into the woods. I know this thing is up there. I know what I saw. And if you don't believe me, that's fine. I'll go alone. You're really gonna hike up past the basketball court? It's late, dude. What do you all care? You don't believe me anyway. Aww. I'll go. 
Listen, I don't believe in ghosts, but I believe in you. Aw, dude. So let's go find your ghost. I was fixing to say something like that, but you said it better. Aw, you guys. Aw. It's not even ghost hunting season. Yeah, it's Buck. We're outlaws. But thank you for believing me. Mostly I just don't want you wandering up there alone. At night. Close enough. Alright. Let's hunt some ghost. Oh, you didn't do the arm waving. I'm sad. Haven't been on a night hike in a long time. Gotta listen for owls. Why? No reason. <laughs> Alright. I got work in the morning. Let's go catch us a ghost. Let's see what this journal is. Bad art, no clues, chased by ghost. Greg rules, okay? I love Greg. How have I never been back up here? Fences work? Nah, people are up here all the time. I came here when I was like 12. What's up here? Just old junk and trees and animals. What is it, B? Nothing. Oh, nothing? I was praying. Whoa. Really? Yeah, let's go. Is this the night in the woods? The titular, the title of this game? Is this the night? Wait. What? I think I heard an owl. Oh, hon. Greg got attacked by an owl bee. What? When? When we were breaking into that history place. I don't think they attack groups, bug. Well, if I get mauled to death, I warned you all. I'll punch any owl that gets near you. Aww. Aww, thanks, Cap'n. Big dangerous Greg, scared of birds. I almost died from the owl. Oh, I love Angus. I'll punch everyone, huh? So cute. They are so cute. All of these are adorable. Wow. Gotta put all this stuff somewhere, I guess. You remember this from when you were 12, Greg? Yeah, I was scared of it. How did they even get all of this back up in here? Shudder. What's up? Nothing. Just like, all this old, old stuff out here. It's here every night, when you go to sleep. So? It's out here in the dark. So old. So old, so old, so old. What? Dude, hey, May. I'm fine. We should go back, this is stupid. I agree. No, it's fine. This is stupid. Ghost hunt, woo fun. Uh, uh, I'm kind of worried for May's mental state right now. What the? Huh? Oh my god. Oh no. Ah oh, hell, he's awake already. Anyone got any juice? No, no guys. What the heck is this? Guys, guys, wait. Love, you knew this was gonna happen. You knew it the moment you screwed this whole thing up. It ain't like you weren't on the other side of this before. What the hell is this? It was a mistake. I owned up to it. Love, this is you owning up to it. Aren't I allowed to make one mistake? One mistake? You left a goddamn arm in front of the click clack. Whoa. Because of you, God knows what's gonna happen to this town. Oh my god, do they human sacrifice? Jeez, oh they sacrifice? What was I supposed to do? It was your screw up. Ah, his leg stuck. And it wasn't like you couldn't have, couldn't have called any of this. I panicked, okay? I was embarrassed. I sure wish you'd called me love. Who's love? You think any of us want to do this? 
Guys, we can figure something out. Nothing to figure out. But, but I got family. Love, don't insult us. You know you don't gotta worry about Jeannie and the girls. They will be completely taken care of. They'll never want for nothing. He's not gonna budge with that leg sticking straight out. Aw, hell. Dave, Rick, Benny. Guys, you know me. Alright, Dave, you hold him. I'm sorry, love. You know we got no choice. And I'd appreciate it if you'd have stopped laying a guilt trip on us. What the hell is this? No! Oh, no. Hold him still. No. <gasps> love? And he's like, ah! Hold still, this'll go easier if... <gasps> There's a squelchy sound. That was a squelchy sound. Alright, he's free. Love. Love. Ain't no one can hear you this far out. You're just putting yourself to more anguish and... Alright, love, chill out. I or oh, here. Yeah. Let's get this over with. Wish you'd just make this easy, love. Oh god, his bone's sticking out. Gasp. What the hell? May? May Borowski? Run! Oh, what the- Who? <gasps> they know it's me! They know it's me! I gotta peg it. Uh-oh, I gotta run. He's catching up to me, no! Uh, what happened? May? I think I got caught. Part 4, the end of everything. Oh, these guys don't care what I'm missing. Nice. Nice. Yep. I barely remember how to play this. It's like riding a bike. I played this game in my head when I'm falling asleep. Hmm, I like go over the plots of books I've read. Ooh, look at this Marty. I try to remember every place I've ever been. In order. Wow. Alright, well. I don't see anyone out there. Just wait, he'll be back. And the cops? We called, they don't care. That's it? Sir, you say you saw a man outside? Sir, that's not illegal. Okay, so got brownies, got sodas. Want some brownies? I'm making brownies. And... Yeah. Maybe lasagna. Brownies? I got some mixed last week. Buy all the food. Need to eat. Everyone needs to eat. Oh, this must be a stress reaction. He has to eat food. Aren't you, like, scared and worried? Good dinner makes everyone feel better. Someone's gotta take care of you. Aw, Angus. You're so sweet. Aw. Thanks, Angus. You're extremely good. Aw, no more than anyone else. And that guy you saw in the woods at Possum Jump. Yep. Were those guys like that guy? Yep, sorta. He had a hat. Hmm. I need to defrost the lasagna. Or do I? Do you cook it frozen? Getting dark earlier. So no word from her parents? Nope. That's bad, right? Yep. Yep. Thanks, guys. I played this until I broke one of the sticks. That's harsh. It was a stressful time, senior year. I remember. Sorry about your mom. Thanks. I'm so tired. I could, like, curl up on their bed. There's, like, a whole living area under there. What are we doing? 
This game had a great soundtrack. Very high school summer. I listened to like half the bands on it. We're going to see the blank tones in a few days. Or we were. I don't know. Guys, this is a bad situation. Yep. Yep. Yes and... Wait, everybody shut up. <laughs> They're not even... <laughs> Look at Greg's face. What? I heard it too. Seriously? What? There's someone standing outside the door. What? Everyone be very quiet. Oh my god. <gasps> uh oh. Uh oh. I'm scared. What is happening? Is this me? It's me. I'm May. Hi. Oh no, May. We never got to go to the cemetery to see Bee's mom. I'm slightly concerned for young May right now. I couldn't tell you what's happening either, honestly. I'm, I'm, all I can say is I'm scared. All I can say is that I'm scared for me right now. I feel a little stressed out here. Is anyone else scared for me? You're so on edge, me too. Oh. Where is what wait, where is everyone? This is where our house would be. This is where our house our house should be down here. Is she dead? I don't know. Maybe she's in her brain. Well, that's the that's the this is the thingy you can jump on to get on the power line. Oh. Maybe it's a maybe she's passed out and she's deliriously dreaming. That's the optim that's the op that's the uh op optimistic view of the viewpoint, maybe opinion? Hope. Oh. What has May gotten herself into, chat? You're not okay with this? I'm not okay with this. I'm in the church. God is here. In this room. I believe that. Times like this, we can call out and know that our cries are heard. Oh no. While we're here, maybe someone would like to say something about May. That would be nice. May is a good girl. She and I explored the stars, and she loved to hear about them. She... I am sorry. It can be difficult. Anyone else? I've always known May as the kid down the street. A little younger than me, but tough. I've been through it in the past couple of years. Addiction, jail, rehab, divorce. And I just think it's not fair. The May of all people should have trouble. Where's the God in that? Where's the higher power? This is all a bunch of bullshit. Thank you, Selma. Anyone else? I'll say something. May Borowski's always been a menace, and I called the police on her more than once. More than once. I hope she wakes up and learns a lesson. That's all I got to say. Uh, okay. Thank you, William. I'll speak up. Go ahead. May was a daughter to all of us on the block. Speak for yourself. Sometimes folks is in the wrong place at the wrong time. I hope we find out what exactly happened to her. Oh, we know. Her friends told us. Yeah, they were out in the woods at night. 
down the end of the center avenue and someone was out there hunting illegally and they got shot at and May fell and she must have fallen off a million things a million times all it takes is landing the wrong way one time and oh well I hope she wakes up soon and tells us all about it see if she remembers who done it I'm sure she oh now we're in hospital. Oh, May. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt. What's happened to this one? Do we know you? Are you here to clean up? Nah, supposed to be fixing a door. In here? Nope. Oh, okay, so. She's gonna be fine. But today, leastways. What? What? Who are you? Is this God? Is janitor the is is God janitor? Janitor. He must be God. He keeps popping up. The house is gone. May. Oh, thank God. What did you say, May? It's dead. What's dead, honey? May, honey. Everything. What is? That? Oh my gosh, I'm scared. I'm scared. This is not the ending. This is not how I'm expecting this game to go, even. Not not the ending. Oh, am I in bed? Ugh. Can't jump. I'm not sure which way I should go, so I'm gonna go this way. We're in a hallway. B? Oh my god, me? Wait, are we at the apartment? Oh my god, we're at the apartment! Holy sh it's me. It's me. You came back to life. I don't think she was dead. Pizza, <laughs> oh no. Pizza party. I'm feeling woozy. You should lay down. You can sleep in our bed. I feel weird about that. How about the couch? Do I have to stop playing? No, the sound is good. Her mom said it's okay to keep her here. I'll drive her home later. So she just like wandered out of her house? Yeah, and all the way here. Jeez. Lucky she didn't pass out somewhere out there. I sure hope she's alright. Mm-hmm. Both of you, shush. No th No th What? It's... <laughs> It's less noisy. <laughs> oh, she's doing the thing that she wanted. Oh, oh, she's doing the thing that he wanted. She, he's doing the thing that she wanted when she said talk with a lisp so it's not as loud. So how well do you know this guy? We order pizza what twice a week, at least. I'm out by the highway now since past abilities closed down. I thought you two were trying to save money. What? Don't police our lifestyle, B. Okay, well just as long as we sure the delivery guy is safe. I can spot him through the keyhole. If it's not him, we'll turn off the light. And I guess hide here until we die. Alright, well as long as there's a plan. Hello? Look who's awake. It's him, it's the pizza guy. Your pizza's here. Uh-oh. You're being pukey pukey songs. So, what happened? We called the cops. Your aunt had and some guy fished you out of the woods. You were like in a coma. Did you die? Nah. Just took a very long nap. Nice. 
Uh, yeah, nice. Why am I trying to eat pizza? I had this dream, or like a vision, or a time travel. I don't know. I'm like in and out of consciousness. Can you not eat? You should eat. I don't know if I can. I guess we're gonna try and eat pizza again. Sorry, mom. You scared us to death, honey. Sorry, mom. We'll come pick you up. No, it's cool. I'm gonna just sleep here. B is there? Yeah, B is here. Okay. I'll be back in the morning. Have B drive you home. I will. Me? Oh, I know. Give us a call if you need to come home. I will. Oh, these parents are the best. Love you, Mom. Love you, sweetie. Aww. Aww. You want a brownie? Nah, I can't really eat right now. Like, I'd puke, but it's, there isn't anything in there. So I'd like puke my actual guts out. Alright. You need your guts. For the moment, at least. What is happening to May? Dude, wild week, huh? You could say that. Let me get out of this. I don't know if we're getting out of this. Well, even if we don't and we're ghosts, we should hang out more. Deal. What even was that game? Werewolf Shred the Gnar 3. Wow, I played this at Casey's house like years ago. I played it yesterday at home. He played it yesterday at home. Oh boy. They've got Wi-Fi. It's like we're a real place. At least within range. I don't even have a phone because of this place. It's the 1800s here. Hey, May. Yeah? I'm really glad you're not dead. Me too. Yeah. 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 And we all like hit the sack. Cool, oh, I'll be right out. Time for sleepies to put forward this story on. Because I'm scared and confused. Hey kids, can we do lights out now? I'm gonna drop over. Yeah, dude! Sounds good. See you all tomorrow. You sure it's safe for you to leave? None of this got anything to do with me. No weirdos are following me around. Oh, right. See ya. Bye, Jam. Classic Jam. Do you know why I beat down Andy Cullen six years ago? No. We went talking then and I thought it would be weird to bring it up now. When I was playing this video game. You were like dating ghosts or something. Okay. And I was really into it. Played it like 24-7. Until this one afternoon. Suddenly, something broke. Broke? It was just like pixels. The characters on screen, I felt like I knew them. They weren't people anymore. They were just shapes. And their lines were just things someone had written. They never existed. They never had feelings. They never would exist either, and I and it felt so sad, like I just lost these real people. And this whole thing we had, it was just me, alone. And like, that realization dumped out of the screen and into real life. Went outside and the tree out front. I looked at it every day. It was like a friend outside the window. Now it was just a thing, just a thing that was there. Growing and eating and just being there. Like all the stuff I felt about the tree was just in my head. And there was some guy walking by and he was just shapes. Just like this moving bulk of stuff. And I cried. Because nothing was there for me anymore. 
It was all just stuff. Stuff in the universe. Just dead. Wow, that's uh... And the next day was that softball game. And Andy was the pitcher when I was up. And he was just shapes too. Just lines someone wrote. Like nothing in there. And I was so scared and angry and just... I don't know. Before I knew it, I was on top of him. Smashing his face in with the bat. What the heck? Just shapes. Red shapes all over the grass. Oh my god, me. Have you talked to anyone about this? After it happened, they made me go to therapy. With Dr. Hank. Oh god, he's the worst. And he made me start a journal. A journal? Yeah, he kind of just said it would be would help me to be able to get my thoughts down. Did it help? Kinda? Sorta? But since this whole thing happened, when I'm alone in a new place, it's all shapes. Like back at the softball game. I was doing fine at college for a while, but I couldn't make friends. I was just afraid of being outside or around people alone. Aww. And there was this statue of like the founder or something. A really shitty statue, like all rusty metal. And it was these shapes. And he was pointing down at me. And I was so scared. I didn't leave my dorm room. I either didn't eat or I ate an entire pizzas at once. I downed cough syrup just to sleep all the time. And finally I got up the courage to leave. And I came home where everything was fine. Where I knew everyone and it wasn't just dead shapes. Watching me. Jeez. Something broke in my head in my life. I don't mean to be like, whatever, but it sounds like you're suffering from some serious stuff. And like, I can help you find someone, some help for it. Dr. Hank already tried. I think Dr. Hank should stick to family medicine and dentistry. And the half dozen other things he does. And maybe leave the mental health services to someone else. Like, there are such things as depression and anxiety and, I don't know. What you're going through, it exists. I thought when I came home, I just... I felt so safe here, and everything made sense for a few days. And then all this. And, and, and... I shush. It's gonna be okay. We'll figure this out. I'm so scared. I know, we're all scared. But we're gonna make it. You should get some sleep. 